Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The search feature in the organizer lets you show various images by various criteria. To do this, click the search button towards the right end of the menu bar in the organizer window to switch to a search view. You can search for people, places, events, tags, and more by typing what to find into the search bar at the top of this view and then selecting a choice from the drop-down menu that appears. The selected media items then appear in the view below. You can click the X button to the right of any term you selected to remove it from the search box. You can also roll your mouse pointer over any categories in the toolbar at the left side of this view to show a side menu of the choices for that category. Then click a choice in the side menu to show the related images. The categories that appear relate to the ratings, keywords, people, and events you've created. For example, if you haven't applied any keyword tags, then you won't see the keywords category. Common categories include smart tags, people, places, date, folders, keywords, albums, events, ratings, and media types. Smart tags are created automatically by Photoshop Elements when you import items into the organizer. Photoshop Elements automatically add smart tags to imported images based on their content. To remove a smart tag from an image, first switch back to the grid view of the organizer by clicking the grid button in the upper left corner of the search view. Then right click the desired image, roll over the remove smart tag command in the pop-up menu that appears, and select the tag to remove from the side menu that appears. To disable smart tags in Photoshop Elements, which also disables the previously mentioned Auto Curate feature, instead select Edit, Preferences, Media Analysis from the menu bar. Then uncheck the Show Smart Tags and Auto Curate checkbox setting under the Analysis Options section. Then click the OK button in the Preferences dialog box to apply your change. Alternatively, to find photos tagged by keyword tag, check the checkbox to the left of the desired keyword tag in the Tags panel. The matching photos then appear in the organizer. Additionally, the keyword tags appear in a thin bar above the organizer. You can further filter the search results by clicking any option shown when you click the Options drop-down at the right end of this thin bar. If you have assigned ratings of 1 to 5 stars to media, you can filter for those images by clicking the Comparison Operator to make a comparison selection, and then clicking the corresponding star above the Tags panel. To show all media again, click the All Media button in the upper left corner of the organizer. Another option to search for images is to use the Find menu, which helps you find images based on a variety of criteria. To find photos using the Find menu, click Find in the menu bar. Then choose a criteria by which to find images by clicking the desired criteria from the menu of choices. Enter any appropriate information in any dialog box that appears if necessary, and then click the OK or Search button. All images matching your criteria then appear. When finished, click the All Media button at the top of the organizer window. Note that when you click the Find menu, you will see one option for By Visual Searches. This option lets you search by visually similar photos and videos objects appearing in photos, and even search for duplicates of selected photos. For example, to search for photos that contain a specific object, select the first photo. Then use the Find menu bar command to select By Visual Searches, Objects Appearing in Photos. Then move or resize the search box that appears so it covers the desired object. Then click the Search Object button to find photos in your catalog with the matching object.
Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.